Hi and welcome to this new video. This is a very exciting day. So as you can see, something is new here. Exactly, I just received the gold phantom and I unboxed it of course. I didn't record this because I was just too happy to get out my camera. But now I already did the first sound comparison. And before, I don't know, letting you wait until I'm at my uncle's house where he has the big high-end room where I can of course show you the speaker in all its glory. I just wanted to give you a very quick shot on the speaker and also comparing it against the Silver Phantom. There are close to no videos on the internet where you see the Phantom, the Gold Phantom compared to the Silver Phantom. And in my opinion, the difference is bigger than expected. The treble is much better than the Gold Phantom. It has way more resolution, it sounds way clearer. And also the bass isn't as out of control. Of course, this sounds really, I don't know, strange because the Phantom or the Silver Phantom uh, is one of the most controlled sounding speakers ever, but the Gold Phantom even takes it one step further, sounds one step bigger and even louder. It is only th 3 decibels louder, but this means 50% more volume. And yeah, this is really, really impressive. I didn't expect this. I expected it to sound a little bit better, also be a little bit louder, but I never expected it to have, I don't know, uh, such an improvement in treble and mids. But now I don't want to talk too much, so please put up your headphones as this is a binaural microphone recording and enjoy this comparison. So let's start with the first track here. This is a track by NCS called Tropic Love and it has some really great bass notes in it. So I will just start with the Silver Phantom. Both are playing at about, I think this is 50% volume because on the iPhone or iTunes music app, you will only be getting 80% of the max volume, but in the DVLA Phantom app, you will unleash 100% of the volume. So this should, I don't know, equal to 50% volume in the DVLA app. So now let's just start with the Silver Phantom. Your sounds way clearer, way more controlled. apologize to anyone in the comments uh, yeah, who I texted that the gold phantom definitely is not worth it but sorry in the store the gold phantom just sounded exactly the same as the silver phantom and the upgrade just wasn't worth it but for now I would say that the gold phantom is worth it a lot I mean it's only $500 more so not that much um, between these two here if you buy them new and therefore I would say that the gold phantom is worth it it's louder it keeps more bass it sounds way more controlled the bass from the Silver Phantom is slightly out of control, sometimes it's, it's drowning a little bit, while the Gold Phantom always remains very clean sounding and very just pristine sounding. This is just amazing. I don't know how they improved it even more over the Silver Phantom. Next, let's go to SoundCloud and try out one more track right here, which I always use. Also, there's some really heavy bass. I'd say that bass response is equal on both, just that the gold pen has a bit more power. the gold phantom has a way bigger dynamic range it seems like the dynamic range of the silver phantom is like this and the one of the gold phantom is like this because it just offers more strength in the bass also on higher levels because sometimes the silver phantom 
would very 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 slightly compress with uh, with very heavy tracks so this was just i don't know the case in nine out of 20 cases uh, sorry in nine out of 10 cases um but the gold phantom just sounds even cleaner even more powerful with more dynamic range which is very impressive because i thought that you just couldn't make the silver phantom better let's try one more track here also with nice bass kicks The overall sound structure of the Gold Phantom is way different. Uh, I mean, it sounds way more transparent than the Silver Phantom. It's just way more pristine sounding. I mean, it's really worth the upgrade. Uh, yeah, when you can pay it. Still, the Silver Phantom is like the second best speaker on the market. It offers great sound, even the white Phantom will be good enough, um, but like the gold Phantom it's just king, it's, it's so good sounding, I'm so impressed with it. Maybe what can we check out next? Maybe some nice jazz music to compare the resolution, because the gold Phantom doesn't have a boost in the presence region, like 5 kHz, which makes it sound clearer, but it has just more resolution, up to 27 kHz with a new titanium tweeter, compared to 25 kHz with a aluminium tweeter from the silver Phantom. And this was the only uh, yeah, critic point with the uh, Silver Phantom. Sometimes the treble just wasn't clear enough, the mids weren't clear enough, but Devialli just fixed this with their Gold Phantom. So now let's check out one more jazz track here. Maybe let's turn it up one notch. You can hear it sounds way more refined. is equal I would say. But this just sounds way more transparent. the entire treble resolution or the sparkle of the gold phantom it's just <laughs> so amazing i don't know how they could improve it even more of course they have a new tweet inside now which improved the sound by quite a bit um, if i were them i would also do it like this because the treble really was the only issue with the silver phantom not really an issue the treble was really nice and above average but it could still be nicer for the price point and the gold phantom definitely just has i don't know a perfect sound signature i don't know what to criticize of course it's not stereo but sometimes mono is also good because if you have one small mono speaker with a lot of power, it will seem even more impressive than if you have two. But still, if you want two, you can pay an additional, I think, $2,900 for another gold phantom and a bridge because you need a $300 bridge to um, yeah, connect them. Let's maybe check out one more very heavy bass track and see how they handle this. You can try but never stop me. This is what I'm made of. I will never ever let go. It sounds just as precise, maybe even better. This is what I'm made of. No one can control me. This is what I'm made of. Can you hear You can hate but never break me. About at I think 500 hertz, it becomes a bit drowning in the bass. It's not. I don't know, fully hi-fi sounding. This is just nuances which you notice. If you have the silver Phantom alone, you won't even hear it, just like me. But if you have the gold Phantom next to it, or a hi-fi system like this, you will notice that sometimes the Phantom sounds a bit not hollow, but uh, slightly, very slightly, just not totally flat sounding, but it has a slight coloration in the sound. And they definitely fix this with the gold Phantom. So now let's try one very last track, also some very um, bass heavy stuff, and see how they sound with this one.
track, I would say that the Silver Phantom had more punch in the bass. It simply sounded a bit more powerful, a bit bigger in the bass department. But I know the reason for this. Those are some real hi-fi speakers and they really need to break in. I have only had the Gold Phantom for about, I don't know, maybe 20 minutes or something. And the Silver Phantom for almost two years now. So yeah, the, Phantom, uh, the Silver Phantom really had some time to break in. While the Gold Phantom still is brand new and especially those big woofers still need, I don't know, one or two days in order to really break in. And I will also do something different in one or two days because then I will be in Poland at um, yeah, my uncle's house where he has his huge hi-fi system with like spectral electronics or spectral electronics and also those big Wilson Audio um, Alexia speakers. And um, in this room we can of course test out those test out those two also on max volume so we will be seeing which one performs better on very high levels because the gold phantom has more watts so it should sound even clearer and it also reaches three decibels louder which should be very hearable so we will check this out in some days and there we will also have even better acoustics than here because he has like I don't know those uh, acoustic foam things all over uh, his entire room so it really is like uh, reflection free so we can only hear the pure sound of the speakers but now I just really wanted to give you this quick shot. I didn't want to let you wait for those two speakers here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Until then, have a great time and bye bye. <sighs> wow.